on the 21st day of our vlog Rory gave to me part one of the story. I am just reading this off the screen so you'll have to forgive me for not looking at the camera. Christmas has always been my favourite time of year. There are certain things in my house even now that mark the days of yesteryears. I don't have a good memory at all, but certain things do appear very distinctly in my mind when I think about my childhood and Christmas. My earliest memory, in fact, is vivid down to colours, though they are rather dull. I see myself in my living room, wearing what can only be described as spandex short, which I guess my grander had just bought from the nearest charity shop. Oh, they're fine, says my mother. I beg to differ. Although I'm sure neither of them saw anything wrong with me dressing in skin-tight clothes at that age, I can't help but wonder if it's moulded me into the now experimental dresser I am. Tights or nail varnish or socks. I see it all as just slightly out there rather than weird. But most just see it as downright gay. Not least of all my constantly ashamed father. Do you really think pink's your colour? He will remark. I saw a very nice navy blue. I saw a very nice navy blue Gap hoodie in your wardrobe only yesterday. I don't bother telling him that Gap has, in the recent years, come to stand for gay and proud. Slightly later in my life than my first memory, say at the age of six or seven, I had just discovered Action Man. Santa had thus been requested a Mr. X, which was Action Man's villain, with facial hair problems, and his accompanying chopper. The biggest present left to last turned out not to be this, although I received them too later on, but, in spurts inst but instead a Spider-Man helicopter. It fired Silly String, and whilst it lasted I went wild. Silly String on my dad's bald head, in my Cocoa Pops, and over the photo frames. You name it, I'd managed to cover it. Well, for whatever reason I decided the ceiling above me was the perfect target. The blue residue remains there till this day as a constant reminder of the happiness I had as a child. Four sleeps until Christmas Day. The chocolate is an unbelievably rare Christmas pudding. And behind the foil is a candy cane.